Yo, how's it going guys? It's your boy Raptor here today coming at you guys with a Q&A. So we're going to go ahead and start with the Instagram comments first and then we'll switch over to Facebook because I, I posted two of them. And by the way, the last question will be back on Instagram if that makes sense because the question was a very good question and I wanted to save it for last. Show me bring it back down. They think it's a game right now. Yeah. But it ain't the same right now. No my name right now. Yeah. Back where I came from now. So before we actually go ahead and start into the Q&A, I would like to thank everyone that gave me questions and uh, just say that that was awesome of you. That was um, I just thank you because you're letting me do this Q&A today. And yeah. So the first one is from young young dot J seven. He asks, would you date Miley Cyrus? Miley Cyrus is a little too old for me. The next question is from Jame dot Avila. Um, do squirrels grow on trees? So I wasn't able to find an answer, so I'm just going to go ahead and guess and say maybe. All right, the next question comes from G underscore warrior underscore 22. And she asked, what is your craziest moment? And so my craziest moment, I'd actually have to think about this, dude. Holy crap. I would probably have to say would be getting lost. Not like just any time I get lost in particular. It was this one time that I was in my grandparents' house riding four-wheelers and I was on this trail that I didn't really know. And I lost the trail. And then I ended up getting back safely. So it wasn't that big of a deal, but I was scared a lot like whenever that happened. Next question comes from Electric Fez. She asked, if you could change one thing about yourself, what would it be? It would probably be the way I deal with negativity. Because the thing about me is when I deal with negativity, I do it by screaming or like roasting people and stuff like that. And that's that's not the way to do it. And I, I wish I could deal with it a lot better than that. DKMan underscore 2001 asks, where do you see your channel in three years? I don't really know where I see my channel in three years, to be honest, dude. Um, I see it maybe at 10K, maybe. 10k I'm, I'm not sure but uh we'll see if we can get there in three years and i see me still doing the same kind of content a little bit just vlogging and stuff like that and yeah ashlyn underscore crop asks what is your favorite sport so my favorite sport is basketball i'm not very good at it but it's definitely my favorite sport cole calder asks what else do you want to approach during the next couple of years just a recruitment to a good team uh one that's definitely going to help me out and stuff like that also having a really nice friend like a really good youtube friend that i can talk to every day on skype josh deal asks do you see yourself getting minecraft in the near future now i already have minecraft on the pc so i'm guessing he's talking about on the ps4 and i don't know dude maybe i don't know i already have it on pc so i don't really have a big reason to get it on the ps4 all right so that's all for the instagram questions we'll go to facebook now all right so this question comes from alejandro i think it's pronounced i i've I don't know um, and it says what's your favorite game soundtrack this one's very difficult dude do GTA soundtracks count like that no I don't think that would count it'd probably be the classic Minecraft music because there's something about it that's just so soothing that I could listen to it for hours next question comes from Brie she asks what's your favorite movie my favorite movie hands down would be Lion King it is a cinematic masterpiece, and um, I don't think any movie could come close to Lion King. Just a pre-warning, I had a major stutter on this next question. Next question comes from Adrian. She asks, "What's your?" She asks, "What's your favorite?" Yes, "What's your most?" She asks, "What's your fav fav?" I'm so over it, dude. What the flip? She asks, "What's your favorite slash most binge played game?" COD and Minecraft don't count. Tomb Raider, hands down. Tomb Raider, no question about that. Next question comes from Samantha. She asks, am I a savage? I guess. Next question in the last Facebook question comes from John. He asks, would you become a vegan for $100? Um, no. No, I w that, that's easy. No, I wouldn't. All right, and the last question back on Instagram is from LARGXX. He asks, what is life? Now, I'm just going to have to hit you with the facts, man, and say that life is where you're put on earth to make babies, have sex, do all this great stuff, get money, and all this other stuff, and it's just a
No, but I'm just joking, dude. Life, um, in my opinion, is just where you're put here to make an impact on whatever you can. You're put here to make your change because everyone's put here for a reason. And, you know, whatever change you make is definitely going to impact other people as well. And that's that's where you got to kind of do your best. So um, if you guys enjoyed this Q&A, please smash the like button below. And I'll see you next time. Peace out.